कैसे हो भाई लोगों यहाँ पे कुत्ते दे बच्चों ने सत्यानाश कर दिया लेडीज एंड जेंटमैन वीगा टॉक अबाउट जीटीएस सिक्स अमीडिएटली वेयर इस ट्रेलर नंबर टू टेक टू जस्ट केम आउट एंड दे कंफर्म सर्टेन एस्पेक्स अबाउट जीटीएस सिक्स दैट मेड अ टन ऑफ पीपल मैन ओके एंड अ टन ऑफ पीपल आर आल्सो एक्साइटेड पीपल शेकिंग पीपल डूइंग हेलीकॉप्टर्स presidency oh shit dislike if not the reason i'm bringing this up is because this post is trending like a wildfire right now rockstar boss thankful not to be releasing gta 6 during trump's presidency yay also i want to show you guys a bunch of posts that uh that were made by rockstar and people actually covering it Shout out to the homie Inter. Check this out. Roll it. Let's talk about why GTA 6's second trailer is nowhere to be seen, <laughs> even as the hype builds and the internet is going crazy about it. Oddly enough, it's not any insider leak or groundbreaking announcement that has players talking. Instead, it's a six-year-old comment from Rockstar co-founder Dan Hauser that yeah. reignited the whole conversation. Crazy, Back in man. 2018, Hauser admitted he was thankful that GTA 6 wasn't coming out during Donald Trump's presidency, citing the polarized political landscape and how it might. Uh. I bro, you gotta go, man. Cause uh, he, <laughs> I think it gotta. I, I think he went. He went. So this meme kind of aged like a fine wine. I bro, you gotta go. And bro, absolutely went out. But that's crazy, right? Cause he said that six years ago, and six years later, it came true. So it seems like that GTA 6 got to release. I don't think they're gonna delay it though. And, and speaking of what Rockstar and Take Two confirmed, so they're reiterating the fact that GTA 6 is gonna be coming out uh, fall of calendar 2025. So seemingly no delay, but you never know. I wanna get down to other stuff to wait for it. It makes satire challenging or even pointless. He said, "It's really unclear what we would even do with it, let alone how upset people would get with whatever we did." Going on to add that the political climate was so intense that both intense liberal progression and intense conservatism are both very militant and very angry. Okay, in in that aspect, like seeing like what's going on in, in right now in the U.S. right from the left, it's 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 insane, and uh, I I understand like what he said, but to be fair though, listen guys, I'm in Canada, okay, okay. <laughs> that, 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 I'm in Canada. I mean, what's true is true. I'm in Canada, and, and uh, the stuff that I know and that I've seen, I guess it's fair to say that Trump is against uh, censorship, right? He loves free speech. So releasing GTA 6 under his uh, presidency should and would mean that GTA 6 doesn't get censored, right? And Rockstar would have full like uh, they would be allowed to do whatever they want, right? Uh, Yeah, right. Even under, if, even if it was Kamala Harris, I feel like that it would have been fine too. To be fair, though, I mean, because after all, America is like freedom, like free speech, free speech, right? But if it was Kamala Harris, then okay, I would be like, okay, maybe it's a maybe, okay, it's a maybe situation. But under Trump, GTA 6 should be amazing. It shouldn't, shouldn't, they shouldn't have to worry about censorship or anything like that. But I, I but I get the part where he said that uh, both the right and the left would be kind of angry. Right now, I'm seeing the left being angry, but of course, that is because the whole, the 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 big man. <laughs> Orange man actually won presidency. People celebrating big man. People celebrating big man. Right, let's get back to the content here, boo boo. With the way things were, Hauser was basically saying that any attempt at satire could backfire. With people on both sides ready to be outraged. Now, fast forward to 2020. I guess people uh, that voted for Trump, they are not outraged though. So before, and here we are, right in the middle of Trump's second presidency, and GTA 6 is still on the horizon, sparking all kinds of theories about what Rockstar might have to say or avoid saying in the game. Hauser's concerns make a lot more sense when you consider that the game is set in Florida, or Leonida in Rockstar's fictional twist on the Sunshine State. This is the yeah, first yeah, yeah. time since Vice yeah, City yeah, that yeah. Rockstar is revisiting the state, but a lot has changed since the neon-soaked 80s set. Of that classic, today's Florida is practically synonymous with the Florida Man mm -hmm. stereotype. Endless viral headlines and chaotic scenes that almost feel like they're out of a GTA game. But beyond the wild news stories, the political landscape has shifted dramatically. Yeah. Florida is now a solid red state, with Dang Trump yo. winning it Dang by a yo. massive 13-point margin this election. It would be interesting, like what happens for sure. And R Rockstar and Take Two, it's kind of wild because last year they did confirm. Trailer one that we're gonna get it in December, and of course we got it last December, guys. It's gonna be one year oh, since we uh, uh, got, got like the very first trailer of GTA 6. Since we ended up seeing the Lucia Bruna and all that, we know we don't know if they nerfed it though. You never know, man. They might have nerfed it too, man. You never know, right? I hope I hope not. I hope not. I hope, <laughs> I hope not. But but to be fair though, like trailer two is something that everybody speculated and hoped for, and everybody guessed. 
that it was gonna happen this year right now it's like a 50 50 guys sadly because they didn't confirm it they just said the game is coming out in 2025 and they pulled out and they said psych we audi right seems like that we're gonna get it but will it be will it be this year chances are kind of 50 50 i mean at this point it feels like that it's gonna come on next year guys sadly check out this video on the screen we had some gameplay leaks and that and we talked about gta 6 gameplay and the dev also responded as well we got a full interview in this one check it out and i'll see you right there